Chris Scott signing for another YouTube video. I'm just here at Frankston Station. Here's the Frankston signage. Opal card right there. Look like I think they're toilets, I think. So this is platform one's trains towards Newcastle. This looks like this used to be an old siding by the look of it. For instance, I want to see a photo of that. Platform two. That's towards Greater, Rankston signage. Take a photo of that. In the far distance, we do have a train approaching, coal train. Take a quick walk up here. It looks like these platforms have been extended a bit. Well, this one has. As you can see, over there, trains towards Newcastle. Low head height sign, which is the first one I've seen. Emergency health point. Might have been a waiting room. Bit of an old break. I don't know what that is, but I'll take a photo of that. Some old Brankston signage. These probably would have been even toilets. Exit out of the platform. Definitely, that is the toilet in there. This is like an old station entrance building. There's your bridge to go to platform two. Platform one seems to look a bit longer than uh, platform two. Do you have a train approaching? I'll, I'll stop the video and wait until the train gets closer. Coming through. TT one one six leading.
and here's platform two there is another sign track just over there that's a view of platform two from this side so what we might do is i might go for a walk over the platform two Frankston station signage so i'll go towards the end of the platform so this is towards singleton being singleton being the next stop and since coming here last i think Frankston has been the buildings here at Frankston have been freshly painted uh, you got your second opal card reader over here um, that's the end of your platform so i think a full two cars can fit on this platform and i think it's only the middle doors on the uh platform two so i'll go, we'll go up the drawbridge So here's the drawbridge. So this is towards Singleton. Here's the platform. This is towards Greater and Maitland. This is actually quite a nice looking station. Station to be honest. Here's the old one, of the old side tracks. I don't know if it's still in use because this because Brankston in the early days was a term a terminal terminus station, so they trains used to terminate here before um the sing the Singleton and Musselbrook stations were built. But look what that's been done up, and all that is that's something old. Station signage, Brankston. Brankston information board with nothing in it. So this has the trains of Skane sign with mind the gap and all that jazz. This would have been an old waiting, waiting room back in the day. Obviously, it's got nothing in there now. It's all closed off. Emergency health point. And there's some interesting history, historical information up there, which if you feel, if you want to read it, feel free to uh, pause the video and resume when you finish. So it's telling you who it was built by and when the station originally opened. And there's uh, the view of platform one over here from the platform two side. Got some plants here. It's quite a nice, um, this could have been originally also a third platform as well. And there's the siding over there, which has been, there's no tracks there anymore. That's been ripped up. But the trucks, the tracks for this siding is, are still there. And there's a, and there's actually an emergency phone just over there. Which you, you don't really see on a platform. Down here you got your speed markers for your trains. And yeah, and there's another phone over here. Which is which is quite interesting. Your signs of no crossing danger. Yeah. Than that it's quite interesting so yeah i'll we'll stop the video for now and i'll resume it once a train train comes through so we've got a pacific national coal train coming past platform one here at brankston railway station Three sixteen leading locomotive.
So I've just walked up to the rear end of of uh, the Singleton end of platform, on, on platform to it, uh, Brankston. I've noticed there's an old, old style looking gate here. Um, you can walk down to the tracks. Something quite interesting just over here are the old signal levers on the platform. Quite interesting. And there's the side track. There's, yeah, um, same thing over there. So yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna grab a quick snap of those. So it's quite interesting. Um, not sure if any trains really use the uh, side track. I'm guessing they might be used if uh, there's road, if there's a uh, track work between um, Brankston and uh, and Singleton. So we have got a coal train um, approaching, going through platform one here at Brankston. We've got some coal trains passing through platform two at Brankston. XR Um, I believe these two platforms are possibly short platforms, but I'll show you the two. So that's a two market car for platform one. And if I 
I'll walk down here a bit. You'll find the, plat the two car marker for platform two. As, you as you'll notice, I sort of slope up because um, the platform is quite low. If you get on it like Maitland, they, they do give you a message saying watch your step because it's quite dangerous. I'm not sure why Maitland hasn't had the upgrade yet. So your two car marker there. And if you look up to the, and there's, there's a two car marker. I think this one, this one, I think platform one is slightly longer than platform two. I just forgot to. And you, you there's a two car marker there. And then I'll get over here and I'll zoom in a bit. Just. Check our marker just there. Four train passing through platform two here at Brankston at a slow speed. Pacific National. TT120 platform one here at Brankston.
notice here at this little at this section here, this is actually some old signals in here. I do apologize on the quality. I'm doing my best to get the quality of um images through. This looks like an old very old signal box. Old um come on camera. Lines. Some old stuff in there. It's very interesting. It looks like it's in better shape than the one at Neath. But so this would have been manually to change the tracks and stuff back in the old days. Old controls. Yeah, it's quite a big room and it's been closed off. So yeah, we're wait, waiting for the Explorer. It should be about to come through anyway. So what I might do is I might jump on uh, platform two so I can get a better view of it. Yeah. Alright. Well, thank you. I just want to say thank you guys for watching my uh, Brankston Rail Vlog. Fortunately, I sort of stuffed up with the footage and didn't get the Armadale, uh, the, the Moorie Armadale Explorer passing through. I was able to get the photos though, so it'll be uploaded on my Facebook. Um, fortunately, my phone glitched and I think I must have deleted the footage, which sucks, but I'll, I'll get it again one day. And. The reason why I'm doing these transport vlogs too, before I officially end the video, is I have a passion for trains and I want to people to come and have a look at this in the next, say, 15, 20 years time and go, oh wow, that's what the rail system looked like back then. But yeah, so I just want to say thank you guys for watching. Bye for now. Please subscribe to my ch channel for more content and I'll see you in the next video.